Hello, hello, hello. My name is Melanie, or G to the MN, and I am so behind on putting K-pop photo cards away in my binders. It is absolutely ridiculous. Um, I'm about to leave for Yoongi tomorrow uh, to see him in LA, and I'm so, so, so excited, but I'm like, you know what? Let's just try to do a quick binder sort. Also, this video is going to be a little bit of a quirky binder video because I'm going to be putting away just Jimin and Wanu photo cards. I don't know if I'll ever be able to do something like this again, right? And I've really wanted to, and I just think it'll be cute, but I have almost everything of Jimin's. I don't, I don't have the lucky draws yet, but they're on the way to me. I don't have the broadcast PCs. I have a ton of face cards to put away, right? I haven't put away any yet. And then I just have a ton of Carrot Land stuff for Wanu. I have the start of FML for Wanu. It is funny because I definitely have like all of Hoshi and Jung Han's like um, <laughs> um, the carrot version sets as well. But I'm like, nope, we're just going to put away Wanu. <laughs> Also, you know I've been working very hard on getting some Junghan and some Hoshi older sets, uh, but I promise in the next banner video I will put all of that away. Again, I just wanted to be a little quirky girl today with my two faves, and I don't know, it feels really special. Also, I think this will make this video shorter, even though you all know I'm so long-winded. But anyways, um, I will link all of my binder supplies down below. For Jimin and BTS, I use the Andy Jack sleeves off eBay. And then for Wanu and Seventeen, I use the uh, Amazon Japan sleeves. I do prefer the Amazon Japan sleeves. I eventually want to put all of my BTS stuff in the Amazon Japan sleeves as well, but I just have so many of the Andy Jack sleeves, so I just I have to keep using them right now. Um, I use Dragon Shields for everything, uh, and yeah, everything will be linked down below. I made an Amazon storefront recently for like books and K-pop, and it is so freaking nice, and I can just send people that link. Obsessed. But okay, now let's get into it. Uh, let's start with Jimin's just regular album PCs. So basically the way that Jimin's uh, album was, was like, there's two versions, and uh, if you buy the first version, Invisible, you get three photo cards. If you buy uh, Undefinable, you get three photo cards. But then there's a random photo card in each of these. But like the pulls, like it, you could pull the same random photo card from version one and version two, right? So basically you need to buy three albums to get a complete set of random photo cards. And these are the random photo cards. <laughs> And if you watched my unboxing, you would know that I just pulled a million of the finger guns, but I'm so grateful, right? So thankful. Uh, so many friends of mine traded with me and my heart's just very full, right? Also, not only are these cards the most beautiful cards in existence, the backs are the most beautiful cards in existence as well. So we love to see it. I feel like I have to put finger guns in the middle because I pulled it so much, but put heart here and put peace sign here. And then we will get into the photo cards. So again, you get this set no matter what, as long as you buy this one. You get this set no matter what, as long as you buy this one. Okay, I feel like they all look a little bit different, but obviously this one is like the most different, right? Uh, so we'll put that in the middle. And I don't know, <laughs> they're perfect. I can't pick, we'll just randomly put them in here. And then, I should have taken all the templates out. I'm like, oh my gosh. Uh, I did set up for this, right? Uh, and again, well, the vinyl still hasn't been announced. We hate to see it, but I'm like, it, it, it will be, right? Okay, this one's my favorite. He has the seven tap on display, so we're just gonna put that in the middle. He's so freaking cute. Like, <laughs> I'd scream, but we'll do this. And these are all of Jimin's album PCs for his solo debut face. I am so immensely proud of him. I love him with my whole entire heart and soul. I still, like, <laughs> when I'm driving, I'm always like, oh my god, like, I get, like, just Jimin music. Like, this is crazy. Like, a full album of just Jimin music. And I still think that my mind, like, hasn't, like, fully um, accepted the scope of that and how, like, I don't know. I'm just very, very grateful. <laughs> I can't believe, like, Baby Army, Melanie, four years ago would have never believed and my heart just overflows. It's genuinely album of the year and it's just everything. It's absolutely perfect. Oh, the backs. Do we like that these are like that? Because I feel like this looks good how they're on the corners, but if not, we'll have to put them in the middle like this. But I kind of, I find that pleasing. I think it looks good. I'm happy with that. So, okay. Oh my gosh. Okay. Let's get, let's get into everything. Did they add more? So they added the Weaver's PVC. So this might actually work out. We'll just take the vinyl out 
and oh also I did get the cardigan the hoodie uh sweatshirt sweater <laughs> knit top uh that also comes with a pc but I don't know if that's mini photo card size or not but I did order that as well right but okay so these are the Japanese pre-order benefits uh this one is UMS and then these two are um uh, Weaver's Japan, uh, the fan club pre-order benefits, right? So I went through Nadia for this one, who I love with my whole entire heart. She's also driven by us. Malis helped me trade and secure for these ones. And then for some of these, uh, and the, uh, Weaver's version as well, uh, I should do, I should have done the Weaver's version first because that's kind of like an album. Oh my gosh, my mind right now. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I've been doing laundry, finishing goes, and packing, like, non-stop these last 48 hours my mind right but okay hold on hold on rewind pretend i didn't say that these are the uh weavers version right so it comes with the qr code that you can scan and download the album into the weavers music app that's these and they are so freaking cute i have these double sleeved and i don't know if i like love the double sleeve that i use because the double sleeves that the inner sleeves that i normally like are like sold out constantly now so i'm like hello but perfect so cute we love to see it um i will take these templates out i'm gonna put these away just because i feel like these are like album photo cards as well right so i'm like okay let me do that but um okay again these are the japanese printer benefits this is ums these are weavers uh japan fan club right so i had these in the middle but i don't know if i want to i might put them at the bottom now even though the templates are gonna be uh not matched up we'll just pretend but i think i'm gonna put this in the middle just because it's like a little bit more farther out right further out um okay i'm gonna wait to put these away these are hollow though they're so freaking beautiful like but okay um and and, and i will link nadia Melis, and uh evie down below and i'm so grateful and this collection obviously means the most to me out of all my whole entire collection is jim and solo debut so it just means the world to me that a lot of my best friends were uh they helped me uh actually be able to complete it so my heart's just very 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 full eternally forever grateful but okay so i guess i'll put this one in the middle this is the weaver's global pre benefit you got no matter what for the first round and then you got uh, one of two of these and I pulled all this one, but I was able to trade for and this one. I feel like I rubbed that very weirdly. <laughs> I didn't mean it. I just was like getting the dust off of it. But okay, we'll do it like this. I do like this one more. So we'll put it like that. But um, this is hollow. And then this is the second round Weaver's Purder Benefit and it's PVC. It's a thicker Lucky Draw material. And basically, like, I don't know, people are going wild for this card. This card is like selling for so much money. I'm like, oh my gosh, but he has a Beatles album. He took this when he was in New York. And it just it is a really good uh photo card, right? But I'm so thankful that I bought it myself. <laughs> That's like in pre-order round, right? So we'll put that at the middle. And then um gosh, should we do this so they match? Or should we do this so they alternate i feel like i like it better that they match right but again um i'll just go over everything these are the weavers versions uh of, you get a random pull there's obviously two possibilities so these are those this is the weavers pvc lucky draw that you got for round two pre-order these are the weavers global pre-order benefits this one you always got these two were random and then these are the japanese weavers pre-order benefits and this is the UMS, which is a Japanese store. It's Universal Music Japan. Um, that's that pre-order benefit. So that is all of these, right? And I just can't believe it. These are all the album PCs. And then these are all the pre-order benefits. This one, that would look good if I switch these two. I don't know if I want to, though. But the backs would look good. And these are kind of like, how do I say it? Like, uh further out pictures right do we like that and then the bottom these are all hollows you know what i like that i think that looks good <laughs> well the backs are genuinely so freaking breathtaking they are genuinely so beautiful i'm obsessed obsessed with the whole entire color palette and everything um but yeah he every i mean weaver said he's gonna do a vinyl so i don't know right maybe they're gonna release it with d-day i don't know if d-day does one i have no idea but i'm not even gonna put this in there 
because I do have all nine lucky draws coming in from Power Station and MTU and Soundwave. But uh, I will fill this out next time. Oh, look at me. Ugh, okay, we will put the vinyl back in here. Also, there's the artist uh, card as well. Like 50 artists, people who did art uh, were selected and they have a special photo card, which is so freaking good, but I know I'll never get that. But we'll see if another page gets made with some broadcasts or if the uh, Weaver's uh, top is regular photo card size. We will see, we will see. I haven't set up for D-Day, <laughs> but I have almost everything complete. Uh, that I'm going to get <sighs> am I gonna brave the merch lines and try to get those lucky draws there's three lucky draws oh TXT is doing them too I'm like I really want them but oh the merch lines look so wild I don't know if I can do it to myself but okay let me see what else okay so this goes into my Japanese uh, photo card collection right um oh I don't know I don't know what I want to do let me see so this is a Weavers Japan uh, fan club uh, card as well. It's so freaking cute, right? They were like, they, they put them in subunits and they like put stickers on their face and V-Men was together and it was just so freaking cute, but I knew I had to have this. My friend Jade did a go for it. All of the backs are different colors, but Jimin's is green and green is my favorite color. So we love to see it. I feel like I should take the magnets out. I'm, not, I'm actually gonna stick them on my fridge as well. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we will put this um i feel like uh, okay i'll take the jimin one out as well we'll just put it here and like this is like a japanese lucky draw like double-sided thing as well right obviously this is like the uh japanese album pieces right but i don't know this is just my little like <laughs> japan section for jimin and then we get in to like a dvd and tour stuff i feel like i have um cleaned this up a tiny bit a tiny tiny bit since you've seen it right uh but okay okay the last photo card we have is jimin's uh yet to come <laughs> in uh cinema's uh photo card which um i don't know i don't know where i'm gonna put it but i kind of sort of have like a yet to come section kind of sort of starting uh, also in my other binder i have his yet to come like lucky draw i think did i put it in here I don't think, I think it's in my other binder. It's a uh, yet to come lucky draw uh, and from the pop-up shop as well, right? It's like his little drawing on the back and like it's like a OT7 picture and then on the back it's Jimin's drawing. But I'm like, maybe I will take those and put those somewhere else. This page is a little wild because this is just the vinyl for Love Yourself Her, which I'm going to guess they're going to do tear and answer eventually as well. So that's why I kept it on this. But honestly, this is not going to stay here, but I'm like, I'm just going to put it here and we will, we will worry about it. We will think about it in a little bit, <laughs> but, um, yeah, Ooh, <laughs> we're going to pretend like that looks good because I do not have that much time, but yeah, I'm just slowly like cleaning up my collections, trying to make like all the pages, like every page I turn onto in my binder, I'm in love with, you know, and, um, I feel like. I'm almost there, so I'm very, very, very happy. But I promise we'll clean. <laughs> I promise we'll clean this up. Let's get into my 17 binders because I have to get out both of my uh, 17 binders for all of this stuff. Okay, now let's get into my. I consider it my second 17 binder in my head, so <laughs> we'll just say my second 17 binder. But uh, basically, my first binder is all album stuff. And then my second binder is everything else. So DVD stuff and tour stuff and photo book stuff and anything that you can think of, right? Um, I do collect Wano for everything, but um, I do collect Hoshi for a lot of stuff and I do collect Junghan for a lot of stuff as well. I really regret not claiming Junghan in this go that I did. And this card goes for like $60. Now, when I tell you the whole set of photo cards <laughs> didn't cost me $60, I'm like, oh no, people are crazy for that. But, okay, so I don't know exactly how I want to incorporate, like, the Carrot Zone cards and stuff like this. So basically, this was for Face the Sun, and then this is for uh, the most recent Carrot Land, and obviously he's, like, holding, and I have other ones, right, um, as well. Um, 
right here. Um, I just don't know if I want to like put those separately or not. I don't know. I feel like I really need to like think about how I want to do things and I really need to think about if I want to collect Hoji and Junghan for DVD things or just focus on Wanu as well. I mean obviously I have everything for Wanu. I, I, I don't have all of his um, Carrot Zone cards right but I, I do have like all of his DVD cards and stuff so I just I just need to have a think on how I want to do that right but for right now I'm just going to put this right here um i don't know if it'll stay right there again i need to just have a think about it but um this card means a lot to me because uh be the sun tour was when i saw them for the very first time so um i also always kind of am like oh well i could put the be the sun card with his like be the sun um tour stuff right okay well this okay that's a little <laughs> 17 has so many photo cards it's like hard but um yeah I could put it with this with his be the sun tour cards but then I feel bad because I don't have Hoshi's right it's just it's a very like I really need to think about how I want to collect but the only thing like I can say with my full heart and soul is like I want to collect everything with Wanu everything right and that's that's how I feel about BTS and Jimin it's like I love collecting Namjoon and JK but I want to collect Jimin for everything right and I don't like having like uneven stuff like oh I have you know John Khan and Hoshi for this but I don't know these were the tour sets for the three different stops in Japan I'm so grateful I have these cards um, but yeah, like I just collected Wanu for that, right? So I don't know. I just have to have a think how I want to do things. Maybe put Junkhan and Hoshi's extra stuff in a mini binder or something. I don't know. But, um, <laughs> this was a tangent that you did not need, right? But I have like, even like the next binder video you'll see, I have, um, Junkhan, Hoshi, and Wanu for the Carrot Land Japanese sets, right? And I love those cards. I, I definitely want to keep my full bias line for those cards. And like even this like this looks so good right like i love this so for power fluff so i'm like i don't know i just need to have a think on how i want to do things then obviously i just have one who's like movie stuff down here i don't know this this was a tangent this was a, a collecting thought tangent but i just need to think about it but i'm so grateful that i have these carrot land cards and also like i want my favorite cards like i like starting this binder out with these dvd cards this is my favorite one card of all time um that i own oh, this is my favorite card even if i didn't own it right but um like out of all the cards i don't own of his as well but i just want to display the cards that are my favorites better is what i'm trying to say and i need to like realize like i don't need to collect everything for every member or my whole entire bias line when like wanu is my ult and like him and jimin will always be different so like i want to collect them very extensively you know okay that was a tangent you didn't ask for but <laughs> Thoughts for being thunk, I guess. But let's see what else. Okay. Uh, okay. Here's the carrot and stuff. Also, oh my gosh. Okay. So I have a bunch of these mushy mushy. Oh, that's definitely FML tape. A bunch of these mushy mushy cards. And if you uh, have seen my 17 binder videos before, I normally incorporate them like in with um, the sets. Let me show you. Um that's his mushy mushy card this is a mushy mushy card you see like i just incorporate them in the sets but i'm kind of feeling like i want to just make a page of his mushy mushy cards and i do think it's gonna like again i'm gonna have to like think about it off camera but like i don't have a lot of these tour sets because it was like before my time right and not saying i'm not gonna go back and collect those but you know it's just like i just have to have a think that <laughs> I feel like this binder sword is wild. I'm like, I need to think about everything and have a little, I don't know, mid-year crisis about my collections, but I just want every page to just, like, bring me, like, I don't know, happiness and like the way that it looks, right? And just be a little bit more, like, do I love these transparent PCs? Do I? I don't think I do, you know, so I don't know. But okay, let's let's just move on and actually put photo cards away and decide decide if we're gonna do a motion movie page. But okay, so here are Wanu's Carrot Land photo cards. I know, and even this page. I don't know if I love it with the units, but it's in here. We're not gonna think about it. Okay, uh Carrot Land uh last year. 
and I did collect Hoshi as well. But okay, this we're going to add a new page for this year's Carrot Land. So I do have nine cards that did work out uh, well. This one is my absolute favorite, so I'm going to put it in the middle. This is the card that you got if you bought the little like acrylic keychain. But it's just my favorite, so we're going to put it in the middle. <laughs> and then, okay, so this is a little lenticular. It's kind of trippy looking but it was like just in a set of 13, you could just buy it. And I wanted it, but we'll put it up in this corner, kind of hide it a little bit, we'll say, right? And then this is obviously a unit, a hip hop unit uh, PC. And so we'll put that in this corner, right? And then we will do the rest of the photo cards. Let me see, uh, okay, 26, 28, 30, Ooh, there's a 29. Oh, there's a 27 as well. And then there's a 71. Okay, so if we're doing them in order, this is the order in which they are. So uh, 26, 27, and then 28, and 29. They, I feel like they normally don't do it like that. They do it like in increments of like 13, like 1, 14, so on and so forth, you know. Uh, okay, 30, and... 71 <laughs> okay so we like it i feel like it looks good i feel happy with that so this is his full carrot land set set the six cards the acrylic a keychain card the lenticular and then hip-hop unit and i think that looks really good but okay let me see this is some home sets and then we get into like uh some uh solo stuff but I feel like before we get into the solo stuff, I think I'm just literally gonna make a Mushy Mushy page and we will see how it evolves and if I add things or not. Okay, and I think I have these in order of how they came out. I don't know if I have all of them or not, but I definitely have these older ones because I bought them in a set from someone and then I definitely um, have the newer ones because I've been buying his sets now for a couple of years, right? So I don't know. Again, I don't know how this will evolve or not, but I think they're so freaking cute. I'm like genuinely, I genuinely really, really love them a lot. But I think it will look really cool if it was all on one page. But that is for the next binder video. I think, I think, but okay, I think everything else is album photo cards in our very first FML photo card put away, which is super exciting. But okay, let's get into it. Okay, I was able to do a setting up video for FML. Oh, that's something I want to say to you. A few people have commented asking me if I'm going to do a hypen uh, setup, and oh my gosh, I really, really want to, friends. I just don't know if I'll have time. Like I said, I leave for Yungi tomorrow, and then when I get back, I have to <laughs> work, and then and I'm going to be a little bit behind on work because of taking time off for Yungi, and then I'm going to be going on another trip again for my best friend's birthday, so I just don't, I actually get back on and hype and scum back on the 22nd. So I actually, I just don't know if I'll have time because I obviously still have binder video. Like I said, I have so many photo cards to put away. So uh, we will see. And I am really, really, really sorry if I don't, but I promise you'll still get an unboxing and, you know, I'll talk about it while I'm putting, hopefully if I pull any Sangyun cards, I'll, I'll, I'll talk about it while putting them away, right? Uh, I used to do that in my, like, when in hype and debuted and stuff, right? But, okay, friends, let me see. Okay, I turned on this page, but I have some um Yijin Yu, uh, face the sun cards to put away first i also have a ton of busak soon stuff of hoshi to put away but again this is just a jimin in wanu <laughs> love fest here at jade of the image <laughs> okay okay let me see let me see um uh oh uh, uh uh daily begging for wanu's face the sun shop pc i have jung hunt to trade or i will give you money please 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 lord hear my prayers <laughs> Okay, let me see, let me see. Uh, okay, I'm like, where did, oh, here it is. Okay, so, uh, oh my god, usually you, usually you this round for FML, it's already putting me through it. So basically, there's a pub, there's a round one pub, and a fan sign. And then now, and then they announced a second fan sign. But now they announced a second pub, which I cannot secure Wanu for, for my entire life. And it really breaks my heart. And he's doing a peace sign. And I just know that I don't. I don't know. I'm telling. 
I'm telling you. It's trying to claim Wanu in the 500 goes that uh, 500 pobs that uh, Seventeen has done for FML already. It's literally taking a year off my life. Like genuinely I'm saying this like I don't like to talk about like member popularity when it comes to like buying and trading and stuff like that it's it, but I will say this for this video because it's a BTS and 17 video it reminds me of JK from BTS if you collect BTS you know how hard it is to trade for JK to to, to buy JK to I mean it's it's so hard like it is so hard right and I'm saying that as like a Jimin collector and I'm saying that with you know JK in my bias line but the reason that I'm able to collect JK the way I do is because I have so many army friends who are just like nice and will like hold him for me and let me like you know trade them or trade for their biases for JK like JK is the hardest member in my opinion to collecting K-pop. I truly and again obviously I don't collect a lot of groups um I mostly primarily just collect hype groups but I personally feel like JK from BTS is the hardest member in K-pop to collect but when I tell you Wanu is really it, it has not been a good time trying to claim spots and goes like it's really hard it's really really hard and I'm like oh the Jeons are just <laughs> they're putting me through it but okay, we're not we're not gonna make this video like that. We're gonna put away his um each new PCs that I was able to claim for uh Face the Sun era. Okay, so basically this is the pob. This is round one fan sign. This is round two fan sign or B, however you want to look at it. This is C, which what a photo card, right? And this is D or four, which <laughs> the range, the juxtaposition, we love to see it. Um, and then I do have these two secured, five and six, through two friends I'm very grateful for. Uh, I was able to join their goes, right? And then uh, Sector 17 still has a couple as well. And it's the same people, which makes me giggle. <laughs> and then um, I did an OT13 set with Ava. But yeah, they've already, uh, they've really, they've really started it up uh, with face this, uh, uh, FML already. I'm like, oh my gosh. But okay, okay, okay. We're not, we're not, it's only positivity here. <laughs> but it really, it's been hard. It's been, it's been hard. And I feel like, you know, I work so early in the mornings that like when people do goes, I'm like, oh my gosh. And then, but I feel like every day I check my phone or I check Stan Instagram on lunch and I'm like, oh, I missed another poem. <laughs> okay, let me not, let me not. Only happy, happy, happy. Okay, um, so basically, uh, this is still Busuxan. <laughs> so basically, there's three versions of FML for the regular album. And basically here, let me show you these because this is the same set. This is the um, the gray set, version three. And basically every set will have a gray back and then they have like the colored back, right? So it's green or pink or blue. So these are one of the cards that I was able to pull. I'm so grateful. I do have all of his cards coming in trades right now. So he is complete. I just now have to trade for Jung Han and Hoshi, but I wanted to prioritize my all. But basically what I'm trying to get at is like, these will be all gray backs. These will be all green backs. These will be all gray backs. These will be all pink backs. These will be all gray backs. These will be all blue backs. You feel me? You feel me? So I have to, how did I say that? Okay, I ended on blue. So I'm like, let's do this. So then it'll be just like a little nice lines. All right. And I'm like, oh, that'll look good. I do have Hoshi and Jungkook, like literally in the big go I just did, where it's like I hold all of the signed album postcards. Like all I pulled is Wanu, Hoshi, and Jungkook. Like that was wild. My end of the year pulling my biases is just gonna be like two second clips, like boop boop boop, because I pulled them like literally all 24 times. It was wild. But yeah, so this will be pink. This will be gray. This will be green. This will be gray. Right? Yes. <laughs> So um, we will put this here. Oh, and that works out good too because that means that the green back is Cookie Wanu, which also that's another thing. I joined two goes for his keynotes for the cookie card and I'm literally like heavy breathing that my go host pull him and that I'm able to claim that man because that card, that card's going, <laughs> that card's going for a lot of Mokari Japan. So I know that North Americans are going to be uh, wild with it. So, okay. I feel like I'm being negative. I promise. I'm not trying to be negative. Like I feel like as long as you collect 17 for like extensively like Purter benefits and everything you understand what I'm saying like that's a that's a full sentence right there it's a period like full sentence but I feel like <laughs> Wanu's just made it extra hard extra extra 
extra hard this comeback but he's worth it and i will put in the time and energy and obviously collecting him brings me such immense joy right hence the i'm just i'm making a video of just wanu and jimin right because those are you know the idols who will always be different for me and uh, i will get all of his things but oof it's a hunt it's a hunt i will say that okay so we have those and then okay so i'm gonna have to add some pages so basically <laughs> this was me like speculating like things that they were going okay so the weavers versions i joined to go for that as well okay so again <laughs> the kino kids manifesting lighting a candle i do have all of the target uh cards on the way i actually have junghans here but again next video um this ended up being they're like bigger they're too big to put in your binder so i can take that out but there are so many more <laughs> so many more versions of everything now it's just wild but basically i said i was like if they do a carrot version they're going to do all of these pops that you see these were all for the regular version and then they did the carrot version and then they made pubs for all the carrot version and now and they have also like brand new chinese stores that no one's like heard of before like km station and like q o o 100s and stuff like that and <laughs> there is you know what <laughs> we're just gonna put it away i'm gonna stop talking i'm gonna stop talking okay so what i'm going to do is i'm going to put the carrot versions well the thing is is like i could do a full page of these stickers and i kind of feel like i should i didn't know if i was gonna collect them like that's the thing but i kind of do want to like i think they look good so this might not be a page that stays in my binder forever but i think it's going to be a page that stays in my binder for right now and then we'll add two more pages for the um carrot version the four random cards as well i promise you home stretch home stretch but okay so this is wanu's version one one and so i don't know um you could they're double-sided right i could put them like this but um i kind of like them like this i don't know i, I just kind of do one of the those stores i was telling you about the uh q00 100 ones the the carrot version pob looks like this and i kind of like it like i don't know i feel like that's gonna be a very unpopular opinion but i just kind of do like I, I just do it's photo card size and it looks like this and i kind of like it so i don't know but again i don't know if this page will stay in my binder forever because i am trying to be better about collecting like non photo card things but like for sector 17 i did collect all the stickers so i'm just like i just kind of feel like i could we will see right but okay the carrot version which is the superior concept in every regard with every member they're so freaking cute i'm like i can't believe we didn't get like pobs in these fits yet but um i do i was i did a big go i didn't film it because i was just so busy but uh and i wanted to get all the go orders out but i was able to collect hoji junghan and wanu's full sets of four like I, my biases always come home when i do goes and i'm just so grateful but okay so all i know for sure is i want to put wanu's one like this because junghan has one like this hoji didn't do it but it will still be cute that way right but um i think i'm going to put this one up top and this is basically the first era that i collected junghan as well for these normally what i do is i just do an eight pattern of um hoshi and wanu but i think i'm gonna do it like this this era and see if i want to go back and collect junghan as well for attacka and face the sun i do have some of his i just don't have complete sets of four but i don't know um and then i think we're gonna put this one here Ugh, or should we not yeah let's not <laughs> these are so freaking cute i'm like obsessed and the backs are so good too but i'm like no this will be good and then um if i do collect all of the members kinos i could put that there if i do collect like full pruder benefits for a certain set i will put these there and i think it'll look really good so that's what we're gonna say that's what we're gonna we're gonna stick with that for right now but i promise you so 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 much stuff to come with um fml so much but okay the last card i have to put away so these are japanese like album photo cards of wanu's uh and basically their most recent japanese comeback is dream and again i'm kind of debating if i want to add those four dome tour or three excuse me three dome tour pcs to this page as well 
I'm really tempted, I've said this before, but I'm tempted to make a new binder and make it just Japanese stuff, but I don't know. We will see, we'll see. That's some more spring cleaning uh, mid-year uh, binder collection crises. But basically these are the lucky draws for Dream, all right? Um, here are all of the album photo cards. Here are all of the pre-order benefits. And this is the room PC, which is why I'm kind of lit. And these are like the pop-up store PCs. That's why I'm kind of like, you're already incorporating the extra stuff with the album stuff. Why don't you just do the tour stuff as well? But we, we will see, we will see. I feel like my mind would work a lot better and I'd be able to sort that if I had just my own like Wanu Japan binder, right? So we'll see. But um, okay, so these were the first rounds of the Lucky Draws that have like the cool different like hollows on them. And then they came out with two more. I think this one is, I don't know if it's UMS or Weavers. I kind of want to say it's UMS, but there is another one where he's in the Rockstar fit and it has like the line hollows onto it. And I thought I had that secure, but it fell through. So I'm like, ugh, but that card is going for a lot of money. This one is going for a lot of money too, but I was able to get a really good deal on it. That's something too you should remember is like it it I know I sound like a tiny bit overwhelmed with like collecting with um FML right now, but it's genuinely like collect at your own pace as long as like you're looking at hashtags and like you're looking through like by and stuff like that like you will find the photo cards for like the price you are like able to pay for it it's just uh <laughs> sometimes in the heat of the moment when it's all dropping and happening it just feels very overwhelming but like yeah like people were paying like 200 dollars for that photo card and i'm like i'm not gonna pay 200 dollars for that photo card and I was able to get it for under $100, right? Because I like kept looking and stuff. And I will also do that with the uh, Rockstar one as well, right? But I don't know, just a good reminder. And I promise you, your collections are perfect exactly how they are right now, right? And I hope that you just continue to fill your binders with things that make you happy, right? And that it's easier for you to see that, prioritize that, right? And prioritize like the happiness and joy that comes with collecting. But I do feel like <laughs> there's just so many further benefits for FML, it's just a lot, but it makes me happy and I'm excited to put everything away and show you guys when it all starts coming in. Also, there's so many things that are still just blurred right now, so it'll be exciting when we actually get to see the photo cards, right? But it's also just really exciting that you were able to finally put away some FML PCs as well and it's gonna look so sexy when it's all put away. I'm like, oh, I can't believe soon 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 right but i hope you guys have a happy may i promise to make some more videos this month <laughs> it's just it's gonna be rough right but i it's gonna be filled with happiness and i'm so grateful that i get to see yoongi and i'm so grateful that i get to go on a trip for my best friend's birthday and i'm just it's it's gonna be a very fun month so i'm just sending you guys so much love so much light and i'm proud of you i promise you you are doing enough you're not doing too much you're not doing too little you're doing exactly what you need to be doing and i hope that you know that and i hope you know that i'm cheering for you i'm rooting for you i'm cheering for you and your collections i hope you're having all the happy comebacks and i just love you guys so very much